And the tipping point in this extraordinary process, the moment that London changed from being a city to being the city, came about between 1530 and 1630. And that is where I want to start this evening. Some of you um, who have heard me talking about the big sweep of English history will remember this graph. Because in the 1530s, the population of England started to grow again. So this is um, the Middle Ages. Here's the Black Death. Uh, population crashes, stagnates for hundreds of years. And in the 1530s, the population starts going up. And this um, is uh, important because while the national population expanded, the population of London grew twice as fast. And what you see here is a very um, good graph that shows all the sort of major cities um, in, London, uh, in, in, in Europe. You've got Constantinople, the largest city in Europe, uh, Paris, Naples, Amsterdam, Madrid, etc. And here you have London, this extraordinary rapid growth in its uh, population, um, again, from uh, the, the early Tudor period up here to about 1750. London's exceptional growth was not due to increased fertility, but due to migration. Because from the 1650s, around 10,000 people a year were coming into London to make it their home. 